Hey, what's up guys? Steven it's Salonga here, and I've got a new video for you guys. Uh, I got a request for Colton Haynes, and uh, here's actually a video clip of Colton and I talking at Mercedes-Benz Fashion Week, a little about fashion and style, and uh, he's a really cool dude, so check it out. So uh, let's talk about men's fashions, man. Like, what's your take on men's fashions? Are you more of like a laid-back kind of guy, jeans and sneakers, or are you always like really done up? I'm always pretty pretty done up. I, I really I feel more comfortable being all dressed up. That's just that's just how I am. I'm from Kansas, from a small town. So once I got out of that, I kind of got to you know express myself a bit with with the clothes and everything. And I've been fortunate to be friends with Richard and be friends with other designers who help me look cool, or at least think I look cool. <laughs> Well, I'm going I'm to ruin the shot because I'm going to stand next to you. You're way too good looking. Oh, come on. <laughs> that is, this is all smoke and mirrors. This is all, this is, I'm wearing a sh shitload of clothes right now, so. <laughs> cool, awesome, man. Enjoy Fashion Week. Thanks for your time, man. Yeah, of course, man. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Have a good one. All right, first we're going to do is start with our guard and cut the bottom out here. And we're going to probably use, I'd say, a one and a half to a two. And we're just going to go in and buzz this up to about right here. And we're going to do that on both sides and the back of the head. Then after that, we're going to go to a guard higher just to blend this in a little bit more, and then we'll have a nice shape in here, then we'll be able to go in doing scissor over comb to blend this into the top. Now we're ready to work the sides in and the corners doing scissor over comb. What you do is just lift your comb up like this, and then work the th just the thumb, and you want to connect the shorter pieces in through the longer pieces so it blends, and that's what is going to create that soft flow and that fade going from here to here. All right, now that these sides are blended in through the corners here, now it's time to work on the top. What we're gonna do is we're going to establish our length, and we're gonna connect this into this part. And we're gonna do that working this way towards, till we get to right here. Then, we're ready to cut the top, and what we're gonna do is we're going to comb it straight up, we're gonna see our guide from our previous section here, and we're gonna cut straight across. Now, we're probably leaving the hair about, I'd say, an inch on top of the head, um, and we're going to continue to work this all the way towards the front, combing it straight up like this, cutting it straight across, and then when we get to the towards the front, we're just going to slightly over direct a little bit back towards the previous section, just to keep it a little bit longer into the front. So when we get to the very very front, like that, uh, it's going to be slightly longer, and we're just over directing and pulling back. That's what over directing means: is you're pulling it back a little bit towards you to the previous section or, or as far back as you want, which will leave this longer in the front. So what, then when we're done with that, you can then go in and texturize by just simply chipping into it like this to create some texture. I do this a lot in my videos, and that's gonna create, you a, create a nice, soft, kind of texturized PC look uh, for when you wanna wear it a little more messy on top. All right, now we're ready to style it, and I'm gonna use a hair cream because uh, in some of his looks, his hair is a little more on the kind of not super wet but it's not super dry either so this is where hair cream comes in um, there's many of them out there just gotta look and see but uh, what we're gonna do is you wanna start kinda right in the front here and you just really wanna work this all in but you wanna get this right in in the front because that's what the first thing that people see and uh, with this particular hairstyle this is this is definitely more of the focus is kind of right in the front here and then you just kinda work it in through everything else and uh, there you have the Colton Haynes style well guys, here you have it. This is the finished look, and I think it looks uh, pretty close to Colton's hair. So um, if you can get this out, tweet this out to him, and you know, Colton, if you see this man, it was cool talking to you, great meeting you, and uh, you definitely got great hair, dude, and you know, keep up all the great work out there, man. So hopefully I'll see you again soon.